Hi, it's Chester at Blue Beacon Computer Training, and in this video, we're going to look at how to create a secondary axis in a column chart. So we've got our data here, got Bob's sales for each month and then bills, and then a little calculation here that works out the percentage difference. So in January, Bob achieved 134% of Bill's sales amount. Okay, so the problem is going to come when we try and plot these values on the same axes. These are so much smaller than these values that if we created a normal chart, let's have a look at what that would look like. Let's go for a normal column chart. Then this third series doesn't appear to be plotted at all. It is there, but the values are so small you can't see them. So the trick here is, first of all, to click somewhere in your data. And rather than picking one of these chart types here, go straight to recommended charts. The built-in intelligence within Excel recognizes that you're going to need a secondary axis. You can see what's happened here is that the Bob and Bill series have been plotted against the left-hand axis and the percentage difference has been plotted against the right-hand axis. So if I click on OK, it does everything for me. However, say you wanted a slightly different chart to the one that Excel gives you by default. Maybe you want a stacked column chart rather than a clustered column. This is what you can do. So again, I click somewhere in my data, and then I go to insert. I can go to recommended charts, but what I'm going to do is go to all charts and then down to combo. So once you select combo, you can play around with the settings for your chart. We want Bob and Bill to be plotted with a stacked column chart. And then Bob versus Bill to be a line. And all we do here is place it on the secondary axis. It does the trick for you. So whichever series you want on the secondary axis, you just tick this box for. Click on OK and you've got the chart that you need. OK, that's all there is to it. Hopefully that's been useful. If it has, please subscribe and I'll see you next video.